created a touchless covid free electronic dice using arduino to play some board games with my son my new project is an amazing way of giving our younger generation the taste of board games while staying covid free This video is sponsored by PCBWay. PCBWay specializes in manufacturing of very high quality, low volume colored PCBs at a very budgetary price. In addition to standard PCBs, you can order advanced PCBs, aluminum PCBs, rigid flex PCBs. They also provide PCB assembly and other related services which can meet your need at the greatest extent. For this project, we need one push button switch, one Arduino Nano, 8x8 LED matrix with MAX7219 IC, step up power module, IR sensor, AA battery holder and batteries, and some connecting cables. Using a step up power module connected to two AA batteries, I'm powering up the Arduino Nano. In my logic, I'm using a IR module to send interrupts, which changes the face of the dice, which is then displayed using the 8x8 LED matrix. If you want to know more about DIY IR module, please check out my tutorial number 21, DIY IR module. The link is in the description below. If you want to change the face of the dice by shaking it, you can use a tilt sensor to generate the interrupts. If you want to store the result in a database, you can use a ESP8266 board and send the result over Wi-Fi and store it in a database. The possibilities are endless. However, I just wanted to keep my circuit simple. The code is very simple. Let's start by including the ledcontrol.h library. I have included the link to the library in the description below. Next, let's define all the pins that we are going to use in our code. After that, you'll find few functions that work in combination to generate the dice faces and the dice animation. In the setup section, we are setting up the pin mode of the IR sensor and initializing the display. We are also showing the initial animation where in my case, number 6 flies from right to left and fills up the LED display. In the loop section, I am reading the IR sensor to check if someone has moved their hand over the sensor module. If a motion is detected, then a random number between 1 and 6 is generated and based on that, the face of the dice changes using the show dice pick function. Now let's create the body of the dice. From a broken piece of chipboard, I extracted the 6 sides of the dice. Next, using a double sided tape, I attach the AA battery holder to the bottom of the dice. Then I solder the step up converter to the AA battery holder. The step up boost converter has to be adjusted to approximately 5 volts before installation by twisting the variable resistance in it. I made a hole on one of the sides for the push button switch and then glued the push button switch to it. I hot glued the 8x8 LED matrix to the top section of the dice. 8x8 LED matrix with MAX7219 driver IC is a very cheap, easy to code and it takes up very little space in your project. The top section also has the IR transmitter and receiver LEDs. Pretty much I hot glued them all and then attached them to the Arduino Nano. Then I made 4 holes on the bottom plate and attached all the sides to it. Let's do a quick test before finalizing the project. Looks promising, isn't it? Cool, so this is how my final setup looks like. I covered the LED matrix with a translucent black sheet. Let me know what you guys think of this project. If you have any suggestions or advice, please feel free to drop a comment below. Thanks again for watching this video. I hope it helps you. If you want to support me, you can subscribe to my channel and watch my other videos. Thanks. See you again in my next video. Bye now.